please click the screen now if you haven't seen my video on humanistic pride. What's going on everybody on YouTube, Sonic Waffles here, and today we have a nice little game of Sticks and Stones on Berlin Wall. This is the Weekend Gambler wager matches, so not rolling in high roller today, but I have enough COD points, so I don't really need to. And today I would like to give some tips on the people going for gold camo. Now I do realize that a lot of people have been 15th and 14th prestigious for uh, quite a while now. And, uh, and as you may know, I'm only second prestige, but you know, that's besides the point. People are starting to get into their gold camos. They're finding the guns that they really want the gold camos on, the guns that they use a lot, which tends to be the FAMAS and the 74U. But whatever gun you want to get them on, it's still going to be the same price. Okay, 50,000 COD points. Now, even for a COD point baller like me, you know, I make it rain in COD points. I have 200,000 of them. That's not too much, but that's only enough to buy four golden camos, all right? And that's not too many, all right? I think I have PM-63, Scorpion, Enfield, Commando, and uh, two other guns in my classes, and that's not the only one. Those aren't the only guns that I use. I use the MP5. I've got, uh, I believe I've got, like, near 300 kills now with the Olympia, so I'm, I'm getting up there, but... That's a, that's a lot of guns to get gold camos on, and a lot of people are playing high roller now to get more COD points, and this is going to be a, my little tip series, I guess you could say, on each of the, on each of the little, uh, what are they called, wager matches. So, if you're in a high roller, and you're playing six and sons, the first thing you want to do is realize what kind of people you're playing against, alright? If you're playing the people that like to uh, sit in the middle, and, no, well, not necessarily sit in the middle, but they like to get in the action in the middle, you know, three of them at a time, get in there trying to hit each other with tomahawks, or not, well, normally, hopefully not tomahawks by now, and you're talking about the beginning of the game, and you realize that they're trying to get in the middle, just trying to stick anybody they can, and they're jumping around the place, you can get them easily, all right? If you get a group of people like that, basically the first thing you want to do is just circle them, all right? If you can just walk around them, then it's going to be easy. Just fire, take your time, because they're going to be focused on each other. Take your time, see if you can stick one person. I mean, that's you can get easy mode uh, doubles. And uh, if it comes to the ballistic knife, just remember, take your time, okay? You don't need to tomahawk people at this point. All right, tomahawks are going to be coming later. That's the first thing you need to do, all right? Then you need to realize who's who, okay? If you see a guy that's got an accurate now, I'm not trying to brag, but uh, when it comes to crossbow, I'm not too good, all right? When it comes to the ballistic knife, you better watch out, okay? Because I, I will fillet you with the ballistic knife, all right? So keep in mind, you know, if you see a guy that he's getting some long-range shots, that was a nice bank, bank shot, Tomahawk, but if he's getting long-range shots, uh, he's pretty accurate. You kind of want to avoid him. I know it sounds like a pretty, it's a pretty newbie tactic, but I mean, if you're if you're looking to win, you're looking to get those thirty th that thirty th yeah, that thirty thousand cod points, and hey, you're gonna have to use some cheap tactics. And now, I mean, I'm not gonna be the first, last to admit that I do use cheesy tactics. Not cheesy, but cheap tactics. So, stay away from the people that have the you know, the goods, all right, because if anything, they're probably, probably with their good aim, they're going to be in with the people that are, you know, in the middle, running around, trying to stick people, so that's just my guess, okay, uh, third tip when it comes to sticking stones, don't be afraid to knife, I know it's kind of asshole-ish, but hey, you, it's best instead of like, I mean, especially later in the games, if you're trying to tomahawk people, get that guy out of first place, all right, don't waste your time trying to find a tomahawk. Get a knife. It's best for you to get, uh, instead of wasting your time trying to find a tomahawk, get 25 points, all right? Four of those knives, bam. Oh, I go on a little tomahawk tear right here. Ooh, what do you think you're doing? Splitting your face open. Okay, so let's see. Tomahawking, now as you can see, I went on a little tomahawk tear. Tomahawking towards the end, that's the way you want to go, okay? It gives time, like... I don't know if you've ever noticed this, but if you tomahawk once, people like revenge, all right? When they try to revenge kill, you can get a lot of people going on their tomahawks. So if you go towards the end, wait, mainly, like, if you start at the last minute, all right, 
and then you get a jump start and you get like your few warm up tomahawks and then you start getting on a little streak, all right? Say you're on your streak and you got 40 seconds left, all right? And by that time, when they start, oh crap, this ended a little bit early. And by that time, when they start their little tomahawk streak, well, guess what? They're going to they're going to have to wait, you know, at least another 20 seconds to kind of warm up their tomahawk shot. And that by that time, the game's already ended. Fuck, this is this is the most terrible commentary ever. I, I'm sorry, I've already done this commentary twice because for some reason, whenever I press stop recording, it just deleted it. And then I forgot that this wasn't like a, this wasn't a seven minute game. All right, this game, like I left the recording on and it's just sitting here like looking at the American flag. I love the American flag, but honestly, I'm just sitting here recording and now I'm getting all angry because I don't know how to end this commentary. So I'll just TTYL.